What's up, guys? It's Shaq from Team Domination here. I know it's been a while, but um, we're about to come at you with a deck profile for Drytrons. Uh, the last deck profile on our channel that I uploaded myself, I was playing Invoke Dogmatica. That was months ago. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Play three Alpha, three Zeta, three Gamma. 3 Delta, play 3 of each name for obvious reasons. You want to open up Drytron names in your Drytron deck. 3 Diviner, obviously. 2 Orange Light and 1 Eva. 1 Artifact Lancia. Uh, I main deck this now because you can, it's searchable um, and Flunderies. You, you, I'm not going to explain them Flunderies, so you already know. Uh, into the Drytron, uh, excuse me, into the Ritual Monsters. Benton, Edison, and Natasha for the Cyber Angels. Ultimateness and Draco. Uh, five Ritual Monsters. That's really about it. Uh, now going into the spells. Three Cyber Emergency. Three Nova. One Fafnir. I was running two. I decided to put in a third Delta because uh, there are multiple times where I just see two of these and it's just really bricky or just dead. One Medionis. I've been convinced to just run one. I like the one. Three Droplets. Two Talents. One Prep. One Called By. And the additional name Foolish Burial. Uh, that is 40 cards in the main deck. Uh, there's honestly nothing I would personally change. A lot of people are trying to get me on the DPE and Scythe build, obviously, because that's the new thing and everything. So, But um, let's go into the extra deck. One Link Karibo, one IP. I put Phoenix back in only because of uh, back row. Um, I may take it out, not quite sure. Uh, unicorn. I find myself not really going into Unicorn anymore. Um, usually when I go IP, I go into the IP with Goddess play. And it's so much better than just going IP, having Beatrice and Ultimateness, go through all your negates with Ultimateness, then using IP and one or two of your monsters for Unicorn. Um, so yeah. Uh, Oral Sword. You already know, uh, Appaloosa. And then, like I said, uh, Underworld, Goddess. IP and Goddess play is just so good. A lot of people don't expect it. I think that's one of the best interruptions in this deck. Because they don't expect you to play Goddess, especially when you use IP. Use your monsters and one of their monsters and just go into this thing. And then as soon as she hits the board, like as her effect says, she's a, I guess you could say Dark Ruler No More, or instant, instant Skildren for the monsters that are already on board. And she's just really, really good. Uh, that's it for the Link monsters. Still play the bad card. Yeah, I do. I still play uh, Lair Lusk Bird. Um, I like her only because I can still make a four material Zeus. A lot of people don't expect me to attack directly with this. And then overlay for downer, and then go into Zeus. Um, two Moo Beta. I'm thinking about running three. Uh, shout out to Jose Santiago, who has been recommending three, and I might actually go that route at some point. Downer. Beatrice, uh, the best super foolish burial in the game till this day. Zeus, Intess, and Arclight. I was running to Arclight, but then I put in, uh, put back in Phoenix. Um, honestly, other than the uh, DPE, I probably wouldn't change anything else for the extra deck. Uh, let's go into the side deck. I'm testing these two cards out, uh, two Denko Seca, because uh, I don't set any Spell Trap cards other than uh, Droplets, really. Um, but honestly, it's like, I, I just want to test this out, see how it goes, because as soon as, like, this hits the board, and if you don't negate the summon, you're not activating any of your set spell or trap cards, and you're not setting sp any spell and trap cards as long as she's on the board. Um, Nibiru, self-explanatory. 
draw, self-explanatory. Um, dark ruler no more if when I side out the droplets, if I side out the droplets, but most of the time I will, especially if I'm going second. Cosmic for back row hate, Feather Duster for back row hate. Last card is uh, Red Reboot. Um, I've been changing around the uh, side deck recently. Uh, I have no complaints, but we're gonna test the uh, Denko Seconds today. So, um, yeah guys, peace.